what's the deal with Freddy Ramos? If you don't know, Freddy Ramos is the man behind Ramos Customs or Ramos Custom Sheaths. Freddy claims that he will make you the best darn sheath you will ever own. In this video, we'll be looking at three of Freddy's custom sheaths. These are sheaths that I ordered and had made. I got no special discount or anything like that. There's no affiliation. These are just things I bought the same way you would from Ramos Customs. Let's take a look at them. Uh, the first one you'll see here is a, a heavy made sheath for a bussy combat. It is a Team uh, Jiminy. Uh, I think this one's an ultralight brigade. As you can see, it is a very well made sheath. Very heavy, very thick. Um, this is a large knife. Um, the leather that's used on this is a very uh, high quality leather. It's a very thick leather. Get the knife out of this sheath here. As you can see, uh, the tooling and the detail on the sheath and the thickness of it. And then we've also got a, a swamp rat knife, which is a rat mandu, which I believe swamp rat is a division of the Buzzy Combat knives. It is a little different design. If you look at the rivets that are going around it, um, it has the type of belt loop at the top that is adjustable that allows the sheath to move. I like that a lot. It's good for when you squat or sit. Um, it comes with a ferro rod holder and a pouch like the Bussy Knife did, except it's slightly larger. In fact, in this one, I've already got a, uh, an Altoid box that's outfitted with uh, survival necessities. It's got an elastic band, helps you get it out. Um, very well made, heavy sheath. The rings on it, the, the metal fasteners on it. Everything about it screams quality. It is heavy and it's well made. Um, the Ratman Dew is also a heavy knife uh, for its size, as is, um, even though I've got the lighter version of the Team Jiminy, it's still a, a chunky, heavy knife. And the third knife here, the third sheath, um, is one that Ramos Customs made for my K Bar Becker. BK2. If you're not familiar with that knife, it is also a very chunky knife, um, a very thick knife. It's a great knife for camping and batoning. Um, and so it's a very similar made sheath. Um, Ramos does custom sheaths. These are just, these are the designs that I prefer um, for my knives. This one again has the um, adjustable belt. Uh, holster there where it can move with you as you move and it also has a, a slot for a ferro rod and then the uh, the place again for you could put like an Altoid box and make a little uh, tender survival thing I think I've got some fishing line of different things um, some cotton balls and petroleum jelly and whatnot um, but yeah so Freddie Ramos that you know these the um, the two smaller sheaths, those are about 10 years old. They still look brand new. And the one for the Bussy Team Jiminy is about two years old. Now they don't get hard use, but um, you know they hold up very well. Easy to clean, easy to maintain. Now, if we look at the weight of these, it can give you some indication of how well made uh, and, and the type of leather that we're talking about here. If you look at the one for the Team Jiminy, it is 13.8 ounces. Um, that's a lot of leather, a lot of stitching. Then if you look at the one, this is the one that holds the K-Bar Becker BK2. Uh, it is 10 and a half ounces. A little bit different design. And then the smallest of the three knives being the Swamp Rat Rat Mandu Sheath. Um, that one still comes in uh, as a pretty heavy 10 ounces. So they're very well made sheaths. If you've got um, you know the money to make an investment on something like a pussy knife and you know the Becker uh, BKs they're not cheap either but if you've got the money for that these sheaths are a great way to protect your investment and very utilitarian um, if you compared that to the sheath on say 
um, a more well-known knife like the K-Bar, kind of the World War II version of the K-Bar, you can see how much heavier these sheaths are than uh, the sheath that would come with the K-Bar. And that's a nice sheath. With the K-Bar, it comes with a good sheath too. But it's just nothing compared to the Ramos Customs. So Freddy Ramos says he'll make you the best darn sheath you'll ever own. Did he lie? Well, I'd have to say he kind of did because in my case, he made the best darn sheaths that I own. Anyway, Ramos Customs, no affiliation to them whatsoever. Uh, their website is RamosCustoms.com and um, of course he's got, I think, an eBay store as well. So if you're interested in that, visit him and, and check him out. Otherwise, you can subscribe and if you like the video, click the like button and we will see you on the next one. Cheers.